Hello and welcome to the first episode of my VHS series. All of these videos were filmed on an analog camera roughly 20 years ago, so I hope you can look past the degraded quality of this footage. I decided to start this collection of vintage vlogs with a trip to Canada I made with my friends in the summer of 2001. It wasn't my first visit here, and it certainly wouldn't be the last, as it is by far the most exciting destination that was a reasonable driving distance to get to when I was living in New York City. For a visit of the majesty of the epic Niagara Falls, which is visited by millions of people each year from around the world. Niagara Falls is one of the most famous natural wonders of the world. It is so massive, in fact, that it is split between two countries. Nestled at the border between New York State and the US and to the south, and Canada's Ontario province on the northern side. If you're ever in this part of the world, you really owe it to yourself to visit this amazing and unforgettable place. One of the best ways to experience these waterfalls is by boarding the legendary Made of the Mist boat tour to get a one-of-a-kind up-close and personal view of the awesome power of over 3,000 tons of water coming down every second. A simply breathtaking non-stop avalanche. This short clip was taken during one of my more recent visits to Niagara Falls, which gives the best view I ever made while on the Made of the Mist boat tour. This was certainly the most memorable part of this trip, and that is a place that I would go back to again and again, with my most recent trip there being in the summer of 2016, when I made a proposal to Chris for her hand in marriage. But that is a story for another time. I've had nothing but great experiences every time I visited any parts of this country, from the western city of Vancouver in British Columbia province, and further east in the cities of Montreal and Quebec in Quebec province. Our other destination during that trip was Canada's largest city of Toronto, which is where you can find the CN Tower, that held the position as the tallest man-made structure in the world from 1976 until being eclipsed in 2010. Today, it is still the tallest tower anywhere in the Western Hemisphere, standing at well over half a kilometer tall or 1,815 feet high, and it is a truly impressive sight to behold. This glass floor is a popular attraction. Unfortunately, when we visited the observation deck of the CN Tower, it was already dark, so the view from here, especially with the camera, was just not what a naked eye could see. This expression was the moment when I found out that there was a happy birthday message being displayed by the camera. Now, this frustration is memorialized forever. It was pretty interesting to explore the multiple levels of the observation deck, here and closer up to the very top of the tower. In the meantime though, I'm going to close out this video right here. I would really love to get your feedback on what you thought about this 20 year old video and its overall quality, so that I will know how I should continue working on the many videos I was making as a hobby back in those days. So if you did enjoy this walk down my memory lane, I would appreciate it if you clicked on the like button, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and hit the bell icon to receive notifications of my upcoming videos. Please take care of yourselves and each other, and of course, always look forward for more videos coming at you from the Timelapse Traveler.